Alright guys, uh, I made a DK on PTR just because there is so many people asking me for it. It's actually kind of scary. Um, and let me explain a few things. One, DKs don't honestly feel that fun anymore. Um, like, every all the playstyles that I actually enjoyed about DK have slowly been removed. Whether it's Season 5 being a ranged CC spamming, death and decay fearing, DPS with a giant nuke, uh and didn't actually require any items whatsoever to do their damage was fun. And not from like a holy shit DKs are OP as fuck stand or point of view. It was fun just because you could do so many different roles. You could be a ranged DPS, you could run up a melee people, you were still a melee, um, you had some control and it was really fun. Um they completely thrashed that spec. Like they just made it not possible. They moved everything around. And then like in Wrath, it got really dumb with Frost. And it was boring as shit, but it was just, I don't know. Wrath DK was sort of not anywhere near as fun. I'm not quite sure why I still played it, but yeah, I played Wrath DK. Oh, because the war class I was playing before, Warrior, just like died, so I went to my DK because it was already at 80. Um, anyone who doesn't know, I was like a hunter slash warrior very badly in BC, or in Wrath. No, vanilla. What the fuck am I talking about? Uh, just a hunter in BC, and then a little bit of DK, and Wrath, and then the, like, Warrior, and then, like, back to DK. So, it just sort of, the play styles all sort of mixed together with DK, is why I loved it. And then they removed Desecration, they removed, um, being a slightly ranged class, they removed all the utility, you have no more Corpse Explosion, now I don't have Desecration, I already mentioned that. And it just sort of, like, the only thing even fun about the class is just being, like, infinite sustained damage, um, Wow, I need to pop Death's Advance. I haven't played DK in so long. I'm pretty bad, although that was a pro-ass death grip on the Displacer earlier. Um, yeah, I'm still really rusty, and I never used Soul Reaper, it seems like. Anyway, uh, if I had Soul Reaper on me, it would have died, for sure, because that was like six seconds or something. Uh, if I play my DK again, because people do keep asking me for it, it would literally only be for YouTube, and I'd feel like I'm doing it for money, because I would just, like, I'd have more fun on my monk. It's just as simple as that. So, um, I figured I'd tell you guys that, and, like, I've never done anything on YouTube just for the money. Okay, the raid call ad, because it buys me a new, uh, graphics card, which I need. Because mine's dying, slowly. But, that's just, like, a seven-second ad. It's the same thing. But just, like, it gets through ad blocker. It's a nice jump, but in terms of, like, actual, the videos, it's just sort of, I play for fun, and you guys are along for the ride, is how it's sort of always been. So, I don't know, it would just feel weird to do it, like, just play this class and do it for money. Like, the class is still fun, but it's just, Monk is infinitely more fun, and I think I could find other classes that would just be more fun to me. Because um, what I did love about DK is all gone, pretty much. Um, but I can still play it. I just figured I'd let everyone know just where, like, my standing on it is. Um, so, those of you asking for DK footage, I know someone, some of you guys are going to be like, play whatever you find fun blah 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 but there are people out there just like constantly asking me to play DK all the time so I don't know I'm still really rusty on it I've changed my keybinds a little bit just that's why I play like complete dog shit as opposed to just poorly um like if I hadn't played it in a couple months but all my binds are the same I'd still be doing okay but my binds were changed and I didn't want to redo all the PTR binds because I don't even remember them uh I remember some of them most of them but like, Lichborn heals are up. Oh, I'm going to use them. Go. Go, my Lichborn heals. Like, does advance. I think that was bound to something. Um, it should probably be Shift G just because. I think that's AMS. Or that's AMZ. There's what it used to be. But AMZ is like a talent now over Lichborn, so I don't have it um, as unholy. So I should probably put Death advance there if I actually wanted to play. But it's just PTR. It's not that huge of a deal. Um, I don't know. DK's on PTR just for my point of view from it. Uh, they're really strong. Uh, they finally, after four years of telling them they should, took String off GCD, um, which is actually really fucking nice. Um, it's one of those things where it's just sort of been, you sit there and go, why, for so long? And it's like, yeah. It just, it was a good thing that needed to happen a long time ago, and it finally did. So that's a really nice change. Um, Gargoyle now scales off Mastery, which is a great change. It actually hits really hard. Um, I don't know if anyone paid attention to it, but it definitely does just like, 20k normal hits with all your shit up and it's scary as fuck um 
and they do do some unreal sustained damage if you can sustained damage if you can sit in unholy presence which the biggest buff to dk's is the nerf to warriors so you know you are already like the reason to ever permanently sit blood presence is gone like i don't even switch you do lose a chunk of room power for it so don't necessarily need to switch but that's kind of it's a lot better um I like I would actually be like scared to play my DK on live just because warriors are so stupid and it's undergeared. Uh but overall they're looking pretty goddamn strong. Um necrotic striking is definitely still possible. Uh I know I saw people complaining about it saying you can't stack necrotics and you definitely can. Um I don't use my blood tabs correctly. I'm barely using empire rune weapon correctly. I just popped it for no reason there or got blanket sensed on it as he got life gripped away. Uh yeah. But you can definitely turret off Necrotics because I can definitely turret off like six to eight Scourge Strikes for some retarded burst if you just do it right. Um, was that a new coil animation? Oh shit. That was a debuff of, or a disarm thingy I did nothing to. I guess I got dispelled that I'd never seen before. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much my standing on DKs. Uh, they actually look a lot better. Um, that guy just teleported. Laggy. EU. Um, yeah, I don't know what much else to say just because I don't have a huge amount of experience on this class because I've hardly played it uh, but it definitely actually feels like a class whereas I don't know under geared plus live and just getting warriors the few games I did play my DK granted I was with an under geared shaman and could barely kill anything uh, it feels a lot better um, it could just be I have full gear and know everyone's got full gear so I just feel on par and don't feel like I have to do anything outstanding like kick master spells and shit um, but, yeah, the class itself definitely feels really strong. Um, I know it's, it's probably up there for top contending melee, like, probably goes Rogue, then Monk, then DK, then, like, Feral Warrior. Um, Warrior nerfs actually aren't as big as they seem. Uh, it's just, I think you have to change your playstyle up a bit, and everyone's not used to it, because they didn't really nerf damage from anyone. Uh, they nerfed how, like, the overpowers work and shit, but, yeah... I don't know. This was supposed to be about DKs, and I I swear I thought I was going to talk for, like, hours on end about DK shit, but I can't really think of anything. Uh, the conversion change is nice. It's actually, like, sometimes worth using, um, mainly because it has the potential to give you more health than death pack does over the cooldown of two minutes. Um, but it does require some maintenance with Ruin Power to keep up. Uh, if you can go on Holy... or stay on Holy Presence, it's a great way to dump Ruin Power and, uh shift the blood afterwards and then you can like chains of ice spam to keep it up and like each chains of ice is like fucking four seconds of 13k heals a second so you just get 13k healing per second with conversion up so a chains of ice every four seconds if you convert to death um you can do like four so potentially like 16 seconds plus of just conversion off of basically running away uh and using your ruins correctly so it's not too big of an issue um Gargoyle change is actually really nice. You don't have to worry about fucking your ruins and having to empower rune weapon for it. Um, I still hold it just towards the right moments because I'm not used to it. But you can definitely go crazy for Scoble. Um, I still think you should save it to enrage your pet at the same time. But yeah, it's a thing. Um, yeah, I'm kind of out of stuff to say. So DKs, let me know in comments um, whether or not you want me to play it. Like I said, it just sort of. It would feel weird to me just, like, only playing the class because you guys want it and it would make me money. I just sort of feel like a dick. But um, if you guys enjoy it, I guess there's should be no problem in my head, you know. It just it, it would feel weird to me. Uh, but, yeah, they're looking really strong, mainly because warriors are nerfed and they're not just going to murder you every time. So, I don't know. The class looks pretty good. It just doesn't look as fun to me. Anyway, thanks for watching.